So basically, yeah, what is going on, guys? Then, yeah, I know I haven't been very active, been going through a lot of shit and uh, making some money, dealing with some stuff outside of social media, you know, as you do, as a guy like me who's busy, I've been gymming, um, trying to sort myself out, getting closer to my religion, and yeah, sorry, I haven't been active, but um, I found one of the best ways to stay active is to, you know what, I've been talking about doing a podcast, and obviously, I keep talking about it, talking about it, talking about it, and this year is the year of ascension, obviously, within that, um, our church, which is the year we're going up, we are going to be going up, so obviously, I thought, you know what, what have I got to lose? Let me just do it, get the ball rolling, and then, you know, I always tell myself for people who want to start content creation is it doesn't matter where you start it's about the journey and how you get to where you want to because at the beginning it's not going to be great the setup's not going to be amazing it's not going to be the best but bit by bit you're going to level up people are going to come with you and obviously if you guys enjoy this kind of content or you have specifics like once i get into it that you want to see with this then obviously let me know so um before we get started obviously i just want to do to say thank you for everyone who has stuck around and who is still watching i know the channel's been dead and obviously the old videos are literally carrying the channel but yeah Let's just get straight into it. So basically, yeah, I'm going to be starting a new podcast called the MVP Podcast. And for those who don't know what MVP stands for, like, come on, Most Valuable Player. So the podcast is going to be about, um, obviously, self-improvement, gymming, health and fitness, finances, dating, just all stuff in your life that's going to make you the most valuable player. Because that's what this life technically is. It's a game, obviously, and the game can get tough. But if you're the MVP, like, come on, look at Ronaldo and Messi. Okay, whether you believe they, obviously there's been controversies where, like, let's say they maybe shouldn't have won Ballon d'Or or they should have, but because they were the MVPs, it didn't matter. You'd go along with it. Yeah, you might be upset. Yeah, you might have been angry. But when you're the MVP, you have the best options, best selections, best life choices, and pretty much you can do almost what you want. You know what I'm saying? Like, those two are obviously legends. I use them as examples because they've, done something that's mad like i think it was 10 years just them to top top of the world and obviously slightly different both of them and some people rate messi more some people rate ronaldo i'm a ronaldo fan personally and why is that because i feel like um basically um i watched a video pretty much talking about like you know shaq i think big shaq the basketballer he probably could have been the greatest of all time because he had the best foundation of being a basketballer he was big massive like seven foot and obviously, um, I watched this on a PBD podcast and it was like, if he overachieved, he probably would have, if not definitely been the best of all time, but he just achieved what he should have. Whereas there's other people like, let's say, like I think Messi was just naturally gifted in football. It was just there. Whereas Ronaldo had to work hard for it, train and obviously build more discipline. And that's why I think Ronaldo's going to keep playing. And like, yeah, people say he's in the Saudi league playing against terrible people. But if that was the case, everyone would just move to Saudi, get paid a lot of money and break all the records but they don't so yeah but anyways so yeah it's literally just going to be about becoming the best player in this world you need to be an mvp and you need to be respected by your peers you need to be respected by your partner family the things around you the things you do you need to be in shape you need to be financially stable because the world is getting harder and harder and it's like from my point of view certain people have different hearts like some people have difficulties financially some people have health difficulties some people have relationship difficulties but when you're the mvp these aren't difficulties these are just now bumps on the roads you know what i'm saying like if you're an mvp you have access to pretty much the best of anything if your financial situation is great if you're in shape if you have a good partner you the world's yours like what can't you do when you're the mvp like look, look at pops ronaldo he's doing his thing you know what i'm saying and obviously i am saying my goal is to become an MVP and obviously I want you guys to come on the journey with me. I want this podcast to grow and I feel like a lot of the MVPs out there that are creating content and content similar to this are either already there, already big, already successful. So it's like, it's hard to relate because me, I obviously I'll be watching and listening to other content creators such as Fresh and Fit and Strike a Big podcast and like obviously they're millionaires. Or at least I like to believe you see them, they've smashed it. And I'm still on the upcom. And obviously, I want to speak to maybe I can relate to you guys more because obviously I'm still down here. Like, don't get twisted. Down here is I'm I'm not like at the bottom of the barrel, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not the chump. Like, I'm 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 up there. Like, I'm not saying I'm better than Messi, but I'm up there with him, you know what I'm saying? If you know what that means. But yeah, so basically it's gonna be simple. I'm gonna get great guests on as well. I'm gonna get like a lot of people, different ages, because I feel like a lot of podcasts get tend to get older hustlers, but I wanna get young hustlers young um content creators young people who are doing something with their lives 
and obviously it's not going to be gender based obviously a lot of it i am going to be talking about the male's point of view because i can only speak for the mandem i can give advice for the mandem and i can maybe try give some advice to the gal them too but obviously you know i i don't know the female experience but i only know the male experience so yeah but yeah this is what the channel is going to be about um just drop a like leave a comment um if there's any like people you know around the northeast who are doing very well in life you know people you think might be mvps just tag them mvps under here in the comment section and we, we will try our best to get them on i'm gonna try to get like big big people people on the upcome i'm gonna try to get a wide range of people and i'm gonna do all this for you guys and yeah I just feel like I need to get the ball rolling with this podcast. It's going to have a lot of drama, controversy. Obviously not straight away because we don't want to be deleted within the first month of creating stuff. But yeah, we'll try to keep it 100 as possible. Because you do know you can't say anything you want on certain platforms because it's just the way the world is. But when you're MVP, you can. You know what I'm saying? So obviously that's the journey. But anyway, guys, thanks for spending time listening. I know I have rambled on quite a lot. But I appreciate this. I appreciate everyone who stuck around. And this year, bro, the year of ascension, you already know what it is. Let's flip and go.